<laughs> Hi, this video is the FUE Donut Scar uh, demonstration after a year. And this is uh, FUE mean follicular unit extraction. That means uh, harvest one at a time. Leave your thousand dots of scar and allow you to wear your hair short or long and you're not going to see the scar. <laughs> That's the thing about the FUE. Uh, there's always pro and con. And the strip method, on the other hand, FUT, FUSS, or Call strip harvesting, we cut out the whole strip of skin, we take it out, and we close it down, stitch you up. The strip will leave you a permanent leaning scar for the rest of your life. Um, so, on, so the the pro of the FUE is less less invasive than the FUT, less painful, uh, faster healing, uh, less chance of infection. Um, but there's always you know pro and there's con. Um, the the downside of the FUE are it's more expensive, it's more labor. The number of graphs we can do is less than the FUT. The FUE we can do two thousand to three thousand graph a day, where so it's more preferred by the client who have mild to moderate hair loss. On the other hand, the strip method uh, can harvest three thousand five hundred to six thousand graph per day, uh, so that's more preferred by advanced hair loss. So this is the demonstration of the FUE, uh, and again, uh, they harvest less uh, number of graph, more expensive, and the donor overall donor density will be decreased. Um, uh, when it, uh, when you do the FUE. On the other hand, the strip method when we cut, uh, it only the air, hair taken out, but the density be above and below the scar is still intact. So again, the downside of the FUE are more uh, more expensive, more labor, uh, less number of graph we can harvest per day, 2,000, 3,000 max per day. On average, 2,000 2,250. The overall donor density is less and uh, decrease and uh, the growth rate now you can have excellent result with my work whether you do FUE or FUT but if you compare my FUE to my FUT the, the FUE will be have 10% less density than the FUT on the other hand the strip method is cheaper it gives you the best result we can harvest the uh, bigger number of graph per day 3500 to 6000 and it's more preferred by advanced and loss and the strip method doesn't decrease the overall density um, it reduce it will the the graph taken down is be gone. However, the density above and below the scar is still intact. Um, the, the the downside of the strip method is more invasive, more painful, uh, more chance of infection, and you have a permanent linear scar. When you wear your hair short, the scar is gonna be visible. Um, so this is the demonstration of the FUE donor scar. This is completely shaved with a clipper without a guard. I perform both the FUE and FUT, both produce scar. The result varies from one individual to another. Some could be better than this and some could be worse than this. Thank you.